Amen. This my domain, man. It's my castle. I'm about to get used to it. Uh, I'm about to stretch. I pretty much want to see what I want to do, man. It's been a long time since I've been doing home workouts. And I realized this got to be the new routine because I'll be up all night, make sure the channel running smooth and uh, editing and all that good shit for the channel. Feel me? So my sleep schedule went down completely here. I don't go to sleep till like very late in the morning. And I get up around noon just to make sure I do my daily things, daily habits, uh, stretch, workout, read, all that. It's basically what this grateful. This is basically what this grateful this video about. Uh, I'm just truly grateful for my life and only my life. I don't want to be nobody else. I don't want to act like nobody else. I don't want to be poisoned like nobody else. I want to choose my poison, and my poison is whatever I did. I decided to consume, and I know take full responsibility for that. Feel me? If you don't take responsibility, that's what makes you tough. Feel me? You're stretching your chest, your shoulders, back of your shoulders. Ah, all that it's gonna hurt, but believe me, that's a stretcher. It's help you so you won't get injured. Cause uh, when I do home workout stuff. I do 10 times crazier, bro. Turn it to the back way. Stretch your back muscles out. <sighs> Hurt like a motherfucker, bro. Believe me, bro. Y'all gonna get right. <sighs> this builds your, uh, your resistance to uncomfortable positions. Say, uh, um, somebody got you in choco. Somebody got you a choco, like this, you know what I'm saying? They got you like this instead of doing this. You could, uh, how you pull like they, they arms, <sighs> resistance, you feel me? So it's good to keep doing that. I recommend y'all doing between 100 to 1,000 of these, not daily, but uh, every three days. So in a three day span, at least do 1,000 of those. You feel me? You gonna feel the difference, you gonna feel the, uh, the resistance different, you gonna be strong, you go for the strongest for it. Uh stretch, usually see your legs, try to make sure y'all get me. Uh, I stayed on there for about like five, ten seconds. I'm gonna stop on the bullshit. I'm gonna get to y'all when I work out. Stop, I want to stop at 25, five more. I want to stop at 30, five more. That's how you build limitless discipline. It's a lot of free game. A lot of y'all need to know. When your body want to give up, your mom want to give up, 
you push your mind, your body to that extra push. And that extra line, that extra, whatever folks you want to call it, you know? Your mind try to limit you, but your body can handle more. But you don't know that because you're so submissive to your brain. You feel me? Your brain just telling you what, what muscle is getting worked. I'm jumping a lot. My calves, my delts, all that shit is getting worked, right? So when it goes sore, a lot of you stop. You're supposed to keep going. That builds that limitless in your mind and builds that limitless in your body. Like, okay, we did a thousand jump builds. Now we can do 2,000. You feel me? No problem. So you better feel that self discipline. share about the video game you know? even though I cut that out One more. Six more. Let's go. Six more. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's go. I took Big ass man. This nigga just hanging by the ledge too. I'm about to show y'all this nigga. Yeah, you see that? See that nigga right there? Big ass nigga just hanging right there. I ain't even peeping. I will hit his ass with the broom. I'm gonna leave him alone today. I ain't gonna be here that long. <laughs> you fucking with bro, he got it. Big ass nigga, bro. Like. We're gonna do one more shit of this shit. Cause then do the rest of my uh, my routine. I gotta keep it pushing, check shit, I gotta uh, I gotta eat, all that shit. Then by the end, which about that time for me to go to work. Uh the goal is to take another shower. So the goal is to get sweaty enough to take another shower. That's the goal. Then I get your official weight in. And then, uh, yeah, we're gonna go from there. So, I'm about to thug it out with these dumbbells and shit. I'm gonna get y'all the rest of this vlog, man. I feel like keeping hunting with y'all right now. Work out, bro. Stock is so mad, poison you should assume, bro. It's just killing you, bro. You get a better, you get a better release of dopamine, which is all kind of high. It relaxes you whole entire day. Better than any substance could. Better than any <laughs> thing. I'm gonna blurt that out. I don't even need to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Man, better than anything, bro. All you gotta do is just work out your body, bro. You sitting there being a fat slob for what, bro? All you gotta do is get out here and work out your body. You don't need to go to the gym, bro. I barely had time to go to the gym, but I have equipment from my past from when I was doing home workouts. You could do the same. It's a 
Bro, it's $20 to get you a kit to start working out. But instead, you want to get $20 worth of weed? $20 worth of drugs? Shit that's going to kill you? Shit that you can't even be here for your kids, your family, bro? Let's be 100, bro. If you out here spending your last dub on some weed instead of bettering yourself some food or whatever, bro, you a buster, bro. I'm being 100 with you. Because like, you got to look at it from a bigger perspective. Oh, it's just a little weed. That's what you say every time you buy it, but you buy it every week. With your check. You feel me? Your last 20, you go buy some weed. Come on, bro. Y'all niggas gotta get serious out here, bro. Especially some of y'all talking about y'all wanna be rich. If you can't self discipline yourself in drugs, how you gonna dis uh, discipline yourself for getting rich, bro? Let's be 100. You can't. You can't. You gonna spend your last thousand on weed, spend your last, instead of investing in the stocks, instead of doing this and that. You see, it's a lot of shit you gotta put before addiction. That's why it's good to have no addictions. Y'all y'all get what I'm saying? I'm not knocking people that smoke weed. I'm not knocking people that do, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying for the people that are here trying to be something. Really think about it, bro. I'm trying to save you. Really think about it. Well, I'm not trying to save you. I'm not trying to, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna talk as I go, because I ain't got really that much time. I ain't trying to save you. I'm just trying to get you so when you think about your life decisions, you feel me? Be smart. Be smart about everything that you're doing, bro. This is my weed. This is my drugs. This is my life. This is who I am. I don't give a fuck who disagree with me, who agree with me, who don't like me, who don't fuck with me, all that. This motherfucker always been here by myself. Always been here by myself. Nobody had my side. I had my side. So really think about that. You on this journey alone. No matter how much you smoke weed with your niggas. No matter how much you do drugs with your niggas. No matter how much you rob, steal, kill with your niggas. You're truly alone. Nobody gives a fuck if you get it. You get it, uh... You go to jail, get incarcerated, you, you be, become deceased. I don't like care, bro. All they gonna have is a rest of peace, my nigga, and that's it. They're not putting no money, they're not giving no money to your moms. They're not taking care of your family, they're not doing none of that for you, bro. You gotta be here for your, your people yourself, bro. Well, honey. Come on. <laughs> See, we about to use this right here. Organic sunflower oil. That's what I use. Mom makes some eggs, turkey bacon. Then I'm making me basically a little uh, healthy breakfast sandwich. We ran out of avocados, ran out of salad. I can't, I can't show y'all my uh, my salad trick. I put fruit. Sometimes I put fruit, sometimes I put nuts in it. Then I put uh, college cheese, turkey bacon, uh, avocados, and some lettuce. Feel me? That's, that's the trick to have everything, all the nutrients you need in one bowl. Feel me? Like, you gotta remember a salad, you can throw anything in a salad, nigga. Don't matter. You can throw anything in the salad. So that's the trick. Let me say you put anything in there. And then uh, sometimes I throw eggs. It's all I use for now on. I'm done putting the other poison in my body. Like I said, man, I told y'all earlier, pick your poison. This is mine right here. Healthy poison, man. Right? Feel me? I know everything's not going to be good for you. Hey. It's life, bro. And God made us like, he made it like that for a reason. So fuck it. I got an apple. I got some apples. I'm about to smack on the apple. I'm going to pack these some fruit for lunch. Uh, I got the turkey bacon right here. 60% uh, less sodium. Then, da 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 Oh, I thought they were saying that it's mixed with pork bacon. I was about to throw the shit in the trash. Like, I, I, I don't eat pork at all, bro. I don't want nothing to do with pork. I don't eat pork at all. Uh... <clears throat> That's why I really thought it's it. Oh, I got some sweet potatoes in there. I don't got enough time to prep it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to uh, wake up early. I'm gonna have to wake up early and prep that. Sweet potatoes. Got some eggs. I wanna make some baked sweet potatoes. I'm probably gonna eat that uh, tomorrow at lunch. Tomorrow, lunchtime. 
I'm about to, I'm about to slam, nigga. Those sweet potatoes. I'm gonna make the oven ones. I, I made, I used to make back in the day. The ones in the oven, crack. That's what I'm telling you. It's like crack, bro. Them bitches crack. Done cooking. Here my meal for right now. Turkey, bacon, eggs. Just a little wrap. It was busting yesterday, but it probably was cracking because it had the avocado. I ain't got no avocado. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> ah, I'm so love that. But yeah, I'm about to smack on this. Uh, we about to draw the rest of the blood together. Let's go. That's what I'm doing right now. Eating this shit. I got the uh, sparkling water right here. I ain't never tried this kind. But I'm about to, I'm about to try right now. Oh, this is nice. It's nice. Yeah, monster. It's nice right here. Clear the cannon. I told y'all I was gonna be Japanese. Ah. Gotta finish our food right here. So it's basically about to do. And then when I get done doing the rest of my daily routine and shit, we're gonna get to right now I'm about the bullshit. Watch some bullshit right now. Just because, nigga, I want to. I don't give a fuck. I work hard, so I can do what the fuck I want. So we about to sit here, chill, eat, and watch this little bullshit. Why not? So all I do when I'm at work, bro. Listen to podcasts, uh, read a book. Right now I'm eating this shit. But you, yeah, I'm about to read a book in this shit. Just want to show y'all. That's all I do when I'm at work. Just continue learning, continue learning, continue learning. Feel me? Shit never stop. I just got done finished eating this shit. But basically, this book right here, David Goggins, You Can't Hurt Me. I gotta restart this shit. So I'm starting on page one. So if y'all wonder why, I think I'm bullshitting for the video. I'm actually about to read. But, feel me? I gotta start back from page one. Just because. I ain't read this shit. I ain't read this book in minutes. No lie. And then I 
out, pour me up some drops. Y'all said rich me, nigga. Y'all ain't on no block. Keep your legs closed, cause all I want is talk. I pull up and you pull up. Y'all gon' call the cops. I just pop it just to hit that 30 rounds. I'm sending the job. Pull up at your mama's house and put some rounds in the club. That nigga blockin' wax, that nigga drown in the club. They put no drugs, got a nigga down with me. I put this for the gang shit. Murder the gang shit. Slaughter the gang shit. Murder the gang shit. I'm on it. Slaughter the gang shit. Murder the gang shit. Your bitch, she on the molly, yeah, I got her booted up you, you said that you was trapping, but I heard that's a lie Back so the cold water, cut the stove on, straight the sides You can keep the skinny bitch, cause I like her fat ass and tired So you all savage, your baby daddy, no, not to try She don't want to chip out of just the head, got 30 rounds in the drop Pull up at your mama house and put some rounds in the drop Let a nigga block and watch them niggas drown in the drop We started that shit, shit, just read the uh, introduction and shit. That's what we're gonna do for right now. I wanna read about some more shit. I'm reading a lot of the other shit right now, so I'm only gonna read the introduction. Then I'm gonna finish I'm gonna finish this book later. I got a couple other books on reading and shit. On top of that. Feel me? Man, I'm gonna catch my niggas. God out the cut, man. I'm gonna catch my niggas. I'm gonna catch my niggas later, bro. My young niggas. On the road to a thousand. Nigga, one oh 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 oh. Nigga, subscribe up. Don't be no lame ass nigga. Follow your destiny. Follow what the fuck you wanna do, nigga. 100.